Here at First Build, it's our mission to launch 12 new products every single year. In order to do that, we have to go through hundreds of ideas, many of which are submitted by you, our community. Today, I'm going to go through the top 10 ideas that went from concept all the way to prototype of 2021. The intelligent EV charger was a way to balance out the electrical load that electric vehicles would pull while charging overnight at a house. This prototype was able to dynamically change the electric load in order to prevent fuses from being blown in your house. The problem we found with this is that they already exist. The intelligent electrical vehicle charger was retired. The coffee grinder silencer is basically a big box that you put your coffee grinder in to silence it when you're grinding your coffee or making a smoothie. Uh, and it came into being because Austin, one of our engineers, just had a baby and he started to wake up his baby and his wife at five in the morning when he was making his coffee. And nobody wants that to happen. That there are actually a lot of coffee grinders that are, already exist in the marketplace today that are specifically made to be very, very quiet. Coffee grinder silencer, going to the back burner. The job site microwave was a portable microwave that was connected to batteries so that if you're on the go, you could heat up your food. If you're on a construction site or camping, wherever you are, you could heat up your food in the microwave and it also had a cooler in it so you could keep your food cold. This was an interesting product, but when we looked into it, we realized we would have had to source a lot of the parts and that ultimately it didn't really make a lot of financial sense for us to move forward with it uh, and there wasn't a huge reception for this product in the marketplace. We still think there's something there and we're not quite ready to let it go. So for right now, we're gonna put the job site microwave on the back burner. SauceMaster 3000 is a device that helps you get the last drops of your condiments out of the bottle. So the SauceMaster uses vibration to vibrate all of the liquid down to the bottom of the bottle where you can squeeze it onto your food. Um, Simon did a great job of developing and prototyping this product. So although it was a really fun and interesting project, SauceMaster 3000 retired. The vertical garden was a space-saving garden that allowed you to garden vertically so that you did, if you didn't have a lot of land, uh, you could still garden, but you didn't need as much space to do so. Uh, the issue with this is that there are already a lot of products on the market today that do this exact thing. Vertical garden, going on the back burner. The Lunabot is a very small 3D printed robot that you could give commands to, basic commands, and it would respond. It was made to help really, really young kids understand the fundamentals of coding um, and, and learn to enjoy it from a young age. So stay tuned for, to see Lunabot in 2022. Lunabot is still in development. The Solitary Bee House is a small bee house for solitary bees, which are not honeybees. Tiffany, one of our co-ops at the time, actually came up with this idea and met with a bee scientist from the University of Louisville who helped us bring this product to market. Um, this product was received so enthusiastically by the co-creation community that we ended up doing a micro crowdfund of this bee house and sold 70 units in about two hours. Solitary Bee House launched. Doug is a device that tells you when to feed your sourdough starter. This product was invented by one of our co-ops, Allie, who was trying to bake sourdough bread, but kept killing her sourdough starter because she didn't know when to feed it. So we're gonna continue to develop Doug and see where it goes in 2022. Doug, still in development. Cavern is a device that allows you to cure meats and aged cheeses in the comfort of your home. We started working on Cavern because we were interested in dry aging meat. But what we found is that all the existing products on the market were really, really expensive. We've been working on Cavern for a few months and I'm really excited to see what we can do with it in 2022. We, it is still very much in development and we've started to work with the YouTuber Eric from Two Guys and a Cooler, who is a charcuterie expert. He's been a ton of help, and I'm excited to see if we can bring this product to market in 2022. Cavern, the meat and cheese aging chamber, still in development. 
Mela controls the environmental conditions that you need to grow gourmet mushrooms inside of your house. This was a really cool product because we co-created it with some of the, the top mushroom experts uh, in the mushroom world who really helped us refine this product and make it something that the mushroom community uh, could benefit from. Mela was by far our star product in 2021. Mela, the Smart Mushroom Fruiting Chamber, launched. 2021 was an incredible year for product development here at First Build. And 2022 is gonna be no different. We have 12 products that we still need to launch. So please uh, come interact with us at First Build, post on our co-create site, engage with us on our YouTube videos. We really value your co-creation and your ideas. And we're excited to launch a bunch of new products in 2022.